This speaker looks good, sounds good and it's 100% 3D printed. I'll show you how I built the whole thing for under $40. Before building this, I had no real idea how speakers work. I was more the kind of person who just buys one and hopes for the best. My goal wasn't just to make it functional, I wanted it to look clean and feel like something you'd actually want on your desk. So I started learning how speakers really work. It's simple in theory. A coil moves a cone and that movement pushes air. But a speaker on its own is almost silent. It's the resonance that turns motion into sound. Once I understood that, I designed everything around one small full range driver. Compact, but with enough air inside to give it real depth. For this speaker, I focused on three things. Clean design, solid sound and a build that's easy to put together. With everything put together, it's finally time to see if all the work was worth it, how it actually sounds and what it really takes to build one like this for under $40. I paid $15 for the speaker, $12 for the amplifier, $6 for the power supply and around $5 for the filament. 
plus a few screws and magnets, let's say one dollar. That's a total of 39 dollars in materials. But how does a DIY speaker under 40 dollars actually sound? And how can you build one yourself? Let's find out. For under $40, I built a Bluetooth speaker that's completely 3D printed and it actually sounds amazing. If you want to build your own, I've created a full step-by-step -step guide on my Ko-fi page. You'll find everything there. All the print files, parts list and even personal support from me. It's one of those projects that's just really fun to build and even better when you hear it play for the first time. The link's below and if you enjoy projects like this, make sure to subscribe. There's a lot more coming soon.